Goal 13 of the Sustainable Development Goals, Climate Action. Discuss changes in the ecosystem due to climate change. Climate change affects the entire planet. Although there are many discussions about how humans are affected, we often forget that plants, animals, and their habitats are also victims of this phenomenon. Changes in temperature and climate can impact plant growth stages, migration patterns, water quality, and many other factors these plants and wildlife need to survive. The warm waters trigger a chain reaction of events that affects all levels of the ecosystem. Due to the sea level rising, salt water invading a fresh water system can cause a species to move or simply die off. This removes an animal from the food chain, which is sometimes crucial for the existence of another species. Plants also face a problem from the change in temperature. Certain plants can only grow in specific temperatures. When it gets hotter or colder, these plants can no longer grow and eventually die out. Natural disasters are also influenced by global warming and affect plants and animals. Strong hurricanes can blow away animals and level entire ecosystems, while wildfires can completely destroy them. There are ways to cut back on the damage that climate change is doing to the ecosystem. There are plenty of man-made factors that contribute to global warming, including our factories and cars. Since we are the cause of most of the troubles, these ecosystems face, it's up to us to restore balance and make things right. Not only should we look to prevent climate change from further damaging our ecosystems, but we need to start restoring the ones that have already been affected. Living healthier and more energy efficient lives is the first step in doing this. The creation of processed food is one of the leading causes of greenhouse gases in the world. By cutting meat and dairy out of your diet, the levels of carbon dioxide being put into the air will begin to decrease. Our planet's ecosystems have been here longer than us. These plants and animals may not be able to protect themselves against the effects of climate change, but we can. It's up to us to preserve these natural wonders and maintain the balance on Earth. <laughs>